rock and roll really swept the culture, especially the teenagers. And the white kids were doing their version of the doo-wop groups and to the point where it became its own thing. Uh, Danny and the Juniors did a couple of things where it's, maybe it's a pop rock or something, but it's rocking. And it is kind of Philadelphia or some kind of Northeast kind of greasy rock and roll kids doing their version of rock and roll. It hasn't been really cheesified yet or terribly watered down other than that they're not black. So this is At The Hop, which probably most people have heard. And uh, there's a couple of versions of that. But, you know, it's unusual to have any of this stuff really on film. Um, and uh, so it's to be celebrated as a cultural history. Then they did, the follow-up was really my favorite of all the records, which is Rock and Roll is Here to Stay. And it's truth in lyrics. It, it, you know, every generation has had like these rock critics or these music critics who say rock and roll is dead or they you know, whatever like that. And then five minutes later it's back in the old form. It keeps coming back because each generation can be affected by this kind of stuff, especially the best of it. Danny and the Juniors, Rock and Roll is here to say, and we've got an illustration by our crumb of Rock and Roll is here to stay. Nobody's better at music than he is drawing music. I have the original of Cubist Bebop movies, the original pen and ink uh, that this came from. <laughs> 